So now let's go to the ox, okay? The ox here, okay, goes up in rank from number nine up to number two. Okay, congratulations, okay? If you have the ox itself, auspicious stars, one whole list of them. Prosperity star, heavenly virtue, fortune virtue, J Ho star, heavenly you know, woman star, eight seats and pulling star the stars. Okay, prosperity star and heavenly virtue, fortune virtues, they are all great stars that represents how to say uh, uh, fortune, prosperity means that money, happiness, okay, abundance. It's all yours in 2024 if you played it right lah. As I mentioned, it cannot be all the ox in the world, entire world also will be going through good luck, right? It means that how ready you are. If all this while, you empowered yourself. You make decisions for yourself. You are truthful and honest with yourself. You express yourself easily. You have no issue. You have leadership. You can socialize, okay? You have great work performance and all that. Next year, in 2024, there's no way it's going to be a bad year for you. But let's say if all this while you cannot communicate, you cannot social, you cannot network, you have issues communicating not only with like colleagues and bosses, with family also. If that's the case, right, even all these tasks, it is not useful for you, okay? Because why? As a person, we are not ready. So please make sure we are ready, all right? So Jade Ho star is also a money star, okay? This Yok Tong Seng means that in 2024, those of you with an ox in your chart, if you are in business, okay, if you are into like a sales, means that your money is not a fixed money, okay? It's like in a way you have a potential to grow the money, it's very good because the Jade Hall star here, in a way, spells that there are opportunities for you to grow your income and your abundance, many, many folks. Heavenly Yid Nobleman Star, I mentioned about it, okay? Right, just now in the goat, you also have this. In the ox, you also have this. Heavenly Yid Nobleman means that out of random, okay, somehow people are able to help you. Somehow, is how come it is stopped there? Okay, on the TV, can someone check? Is this all going fine? All right, so in a, in a way, that's like in 2024, okay, Heavenly Yid Nobleman Star means that people are able to help you randomly. Uh, random strangers are able to help you, connect you. So this year, in 2024, ox, okay, remember? Go out there, okay? Connect with more people. New leads, get new friends, got new social circle, new connections, join networking, okay? For this Heavenly Nobleman Star will help you to bring you up to the next level. Now, eight seats, okay? Eight seats means that, okay, it's among the eight most trustworthy, powerful people of the emperor in the olden days. That's why the Pa Chok, okay? This is like the eight uh, strong people, the eight strong men that are casted with this responsibility to carry the emperor after they die all right so with the eight seats it just means that okay you gain trust you gain in a way like trust from the people around you from your bosses okay and from your superiors as well okay and eight seats here also means that power within you okay this is something that is like going on like very well something to be celebrated of course when people trust you you also have to trust yourself lah. when people trust you and every time tell, tells you that you can do it and every time you have to give excuses you sure i don't think i can do it lah. oh no i'm not ready lah. oh this that that lah. and at the end of the day people will give up on you right people say okay lah, whatever lah. you want to believe you cannot do cannot do lah. okay so remember eight seats mean that you have to have that self-confidence within yourself. You have to stop doubting yourself. Now, pulling saddle starts, pan on sing, okay? Pulling saddle means that, okay, you pull the saddle, in the old days, the horse saddle, huh? you pull the saddle, you put on the horse and off you go. It means that the ox for 2024 try something different, okay? It means that it could be changing department, changing job. It means that it is time, if you feel that your current situation has gone on to a stagnation, it doesn't give you that fulfillment anymore. It is time for you to actually get out from that situation and try something different. It might require you to travel, to go to different places, pull the saddle, get onto the horse, and off you go. That is the meaning of the pulling saddle stars, okay? So again, the same thing. How long have you been working in the same company, in the same department, okay? Right, so a lot of times you will see my students and my clients that are working there for 20 years, 20 over years, same thing. Well, if that's the case, right, you have to ask yourself, okay, why are you still staying put doing the same thing in the same department? I understand you love the company so much, but there's always something new that you can try, right? Explore yourself, okay? Bring out your confidence and try something and explore something different. You gain the trust from your superiors and your bosses, okay? It's a time for you to pull that saddle and make some changes in your life so that you continue to grow and not stay stagnant anymore. In auspicious stars, Ketang, Drape Star. Ketang means that the possibilities, okay? When you see the crossing sha and the Ketang, okay? Means Gun Sit and Gao Sat. Okay, Queen Sit Gao means that okay, these two stars itself has a possibilities of people in a way like how to say a sugar coating their words. 
things that comes to you, whatever you hear, might not be the truth, you know. People sugarcoated it, people twist and turn, okay. At the end of the day, all right, it says like, whatever you hear, don't believe it. Take it with a pinch of salt, okay. People lao jun si sat la, okay. They will twist and turn itself to make it favorable to them, uh, not to you, uh, so that they ensure it's something that they want you to hear. So that is the curt tongue and the crossing sha. So these inauspicious stars will in no way affect you. Okay, so remember, don't fall onto this. Okay, pay attention to it. Whatever that you hear, even though about uh, is about your enemy, people that you do not like, don't jump into conclusion immediately because people might be taking this opportunity knowing that you dislike the person and wants you to take action against him or her by in a way starting fire within you. Curt tongue and crossing shah star. Okay, so whatever you hear, don't react immediately. Okay, you can acknowledge to it and then think thoroughly into it. Think deeply into it. Never allow anyone to weaponize you. Okay, in a way they can use you as a weapon to get their things done. That is the effect of the curt tongue and crossing shah. Now this is also means that you have to learn how to be truthful and clear in your communication. It means if you have these two stars, okay, it will affect all your trustworthiness. If you try to twist and turn the fact, okay, speak up the truth, tell the truth, say the truth, okay. But if you try to in a way try to cover something with like some sugar coated things to make it easier for other people to accept, this curt tongue and crossing shah star will affect you in terms of your trust. So it will affect the auspicious stars as well. All right. Now, drip star here, okay, or the broken star. Drip star can also means pai ma. Pai ma means is like the chances of like like some people passing away. Okay, in the olden days when people pass away, you have to wear that like it's like the is it guni sack ah? Okay, that ma pao is like the brown color thing ah. Okay, so when you have this, is like it means that the chances of they can be like or family members or distant relatives or whatever that may have a tendency to pass away. So you have old people, people who are sick in the family, do pay more attention to them. Okay, if you have people who are suspected of like some health issues or whatever, do go for early checkup, early detentions, ah, uh, detections, and also in a way, ah, uh, earlier to cure. Okay, it will be better. Okay, that is the effect of the drip star. Now lonesome star itself, it means that a person that in a way keep to themselves. Okay, somehow it's like they like to be alone. They in a way <clears throat> they want to stay alone. They don't like to talk to people. Okay, like they feel lonely all the time. That is the impact of it. <clears throat> so you, if you have this lonesome star impact on you, you feel that no one understands you. You feel alone. No one supports you. Whatever. Remember, it's your feeling. It's the inauspicious stars trying to in a way play around with your emotions and your mind. It's not the truth. Do not fall into that. Okay, you have to in a way bring yourself up. Okay, be clear of it that you know that you won't fall into the lonesome star impact on you or effect on you. And in a way, continuously tell yourself that you are loved. Okay, right? You are loved by your people around you. You have friends and all these things. Go out more to mingle and to socialize. Okay, do not try to in a way curl yourself at home too much. All right, broken star. Broken star can also means that the possibility is due to the curt tongue crossing shah means that when we are trying to twist the turn and fact, okay, when we are trying to twist and turn the fact, we are trying to sugarcoat things, okay, in the fear of I like, people might not want or are ready to to hear the truth. Now, whether they are ready to hear the truth or not is not our issue. Our issue is to speak the truth. They are ready, not ready. As long as they ask, you speak the truth. That's all. But because of the crossing shah and the curt tongue, okay, we have the tendency to just. Twist and turn the fact, okay? To tell white lies, okay? To in a way to cover certain things, and due to this, we also might have the effect of the broken star. Oh, sorry. Means we have the effect of broken or breaking something in our life, breaking a relationship, breaking a trust, okay? Breaking a partnership or 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 or, or how to say a uh, um a, a relationship between our partners and other things, okay? So this is something that we need to pay attention to. And of course, positive months, negative months, and also the career, wealth, academic, and health relationship is all here. Yeah, screenshot on it, okay, and then we go to the tiger.